Now, we're going to do this, man. Scott Payne, Scott Payne YouTube channel. Like, subscribe, all that stuff. We're going to do calibration mode. This is 2015 Gibson Les Paul Classic, and it's equipped with the G-Force tuning system. Um, calibration mode is exactly the same for this as it is for 2016, 17, 18 uh, Les Paul high performance models. So anytime that you have to, you have to calibrate it anytime you change string brands or string gauges. Not sure about the brands and stuff, gauges I get, but either way, um, to do the calibration mode, you have to, no matter what you're usually tuned to, you have to tune the guitar to standard pitch, so we'll do that first, okay? I can just bounce it off and shit, that'll work. <laughs> Alright. And there we go, we're in standard pitch. So, to calibrate it, now that we're tuned standard, you have to press on three times, left one time, enter twice. So, here we go, ready? Power. One, two, three. Left once, enter one, two. And you're going to get this. Okay? Flashing red, then you strum it. Still flashing red, mute. Strum it again, and it's doing this green. It goes into that, and it goes back to your flashing red. So, mute it. Strum it again. And we're here with that. Okay? And back to flashing red, so... You strum it again. Ah, and you saw how it went all the way over to where we just have one LED lit and not flashing, which is the biggie. It's lit, not flashing, and that means your guitar is now calibrated. So you can go ahead and Put it to wherever you want. I've got mine set up for half a step down, so I go over and you hit power twice, and then I scroll over to the B where the B is written up red. You hit enter. You see that happen? Strum it once. Let it all tune up here. And there it is. Now I am tuned half a step down. E flat, brand new strings, calibrated, tuned to half a step down, it's ready to rock and roll. You won't have to do any more to it. We're done. And just so you know, I put Ernie Ball hybrid slinkies on here, 9 to 46, but they're cobalts. I use the cobalts, they kick butt. In fact, I put them on in my traditional because it's got a lower output pickup and they have more magnetic pull and it makes it more power so you get more push. You get a hotter sound out of it. <laughs> I like the cobalts. And they actually last longer. Normally I would change strings when I was playing every day doing the band stuff. I'd change them every couple of weeks. Cobalts I could go a month, six weeks without changing them. And that's full on band mode. So I could go a couple months without even changing these things. I still play every day, but not as much as I used to, but the Cobalt's kick ass, man. Um, rock on. Hope the calibration thing helped you out. Got any questions? Leave a comment. Let me know. Subscribe to the channel. Watch the entertaining stuff. Hope you enjoy it, man. Scott Payne, YouTube channel. <laughs> See you next time.